Harry, uh, first and foremost, it's been a while since you've played. What's the latest update on your condition? Uh, yeah, I'm back, you know, fully training now with the team. I think it's my third or second or third week fully training. Um, so now I've just sort of got to get up to speed and match fitness. I've got a few, I think, a few trial games at NPL coming up. So um, I'll be in a couple of them and then hopefully in the next two or three weeks I can sort of start competing and getting in the squads. And, and how does it feel? Are you having like, any issues or are you just training as normal? And nah, feeling nah, feeling unreal. Um, it's obviously been a while, bit of a, been a bit of a journey, but now I can, you know, train you know without even sort of thinking about a knee problem um and you know that's it's so satisfying so i think it was december 2022 when when this happened yep. training and it was, it's obviously been a really really long journey for you did you ever have any doubts that you, know, that you may not be able to come back yeah 100 percent. you have your doubts um you know it's very it's a very lonely process um in rehab um but you've just got to try and stay mentally positive and you know get your little wins on the way um whether that's you know your, your first pitch you know back running um, you know, obviously coming back with the team, but on the way, you know, you, you have your doubts and you, you have your ups and downs, probably more, more downs for me. Um, but, you know, you've got to stay positive. And I'm, I'm lucky I'm at Adelaide. I've had uh, a lot of support from the, the staff and uh, medical team and all the boys, you know, getting around me. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty lucky in that way too. Yeah, what, what did you do away from the game to, to keep you positive? Is this uh, other things that you took up or other interests that you had? Not really, to be honest. I was pretty focused on, you know, sort of just trying to get back playing. I've never really, I've been lucky enough to never really been injured up until now. Um, so I didn't really think it was going to be this long, but, um, you know, I thought I'd just sort of try and stay focused and stuff. Um, but no, nothing really, to be honest. Who helped you most? You mentioned that some staff and some players and stuff were really supportive, but was there anyone that you lent on more than anyone else? Um, yeah, I'm pretty lucky, you know, early on, uh, Luke, I think Luke Dazelle, he came to the club um, and he's now living with me, so it was nice to have a bit of company. Um, and obviously, um, I had a bit of a stint in Sydney um, to, you know, sort of probably mentally for me, um, to help me, so I had my family and friends there. Um, and, you know, I think that, that went a long way. So um, that was a big thing. And also, Carl's been so good with me. Um, always, you know, just you know, speaking to me and communicating and always making sure I'm all good. So, um, yeah, I was pretty lucky in that, in that uh, process. Um, so Josh Cavallo made yep. a long way to come back as well recently. He would have been one of your yep. rehab buddies. What does it mean yep. to see him back out there? Yeah, it's so good. Yeah, because, you know, we, we went, we got injured at probably a similar time. I think he was maybe two months after me. Um, to, so to see Josh come back and, you know, you know, you can really see he's got that smile on his face again, you know, playing, you know. Um, you know, it's our job to play and if we can't do that, you know, you don't really feel quite, you know, part of it. So it was really good to see Joshy um, come back and he did very well when he came on. What's next for you? You're that close to, to yep. being you know, ready to play. How do you get yourself 100% ready? Just got to keep training and working hard and um, doing little things right and hopefully uh, my opportunity will, will arise. The team um, has been a little bit up and down on form of late. Do you see a way that you can break it? Um, yeah, I guess. I mean, you know, I've got to you know, believe myself, but um, I think we're just going through a bit of a lull period at the moment. Um, you know, it's a, probably a good thing um, mid-season that sort of happens, and then I feel like we can go on a bit of a run. We usually do that. We did that last year. We went on a bit of a run towards the finals. Um, so um, I think, you know, we've been putting in some really good performances. I think last two games, I think it was a little bit harsh not to get all three points. So I think it'll be a good test this week against Sydney. Um, but yeah, I think we'll, we'll go on a run pretty soon.